A major global outage on Microsoft systems has led to almost thousands of flights being cancelled worldwide during the busy summer season. According to a travel expert, the situation is comparable to COVID-19 disruption. I definitely do not recall this happening before in terms of a disruption in terms of technology. We did see a similar disruption, dare I say, with COVID-19 when borders started to shut and the skies were shutting because of the virus. While the defect in the software is now fixed, all over Europe, passengers are reporting delays, diverted flights and long queues at check-in. Many passengers will be asking if they can get compensation for unplanned costs. Under European law, if a flight is delayed by more than three hours or cancelled entirely, the airline has to offer the passenger another flight or give them a full refund and sometimes compensation, but only if the problem is their fault. Every government around the world has different opportunities for compensation when there is a disruption to travel. What is important, therefore, is a traveler being very clear on what those terms are. So if it is not the fault of the airline, for instance, compensation is unlikely. If it's weather, if it's strike action, whatever it might be. And this is where, again, the passenger needs to get back to the airline to check and see what is the compensation. For some travel, if it is the fault of the airline, it depends on the amount of time that a passenger is held back. So it is a case-by-case -case basis. Travel experts also advise passengers not to arrive at the airport more than two hours ahead unless told to do by their airline or airport.